drool over this Invita Joseph beauty and find ways and means to start placing your orders this festive season and look glammed up like me. Thank you so much for being here. If you're new to my channel, hi, my name is Inkigali Africa, and you're definitely welcome to my channel. Today's video is all about Evita Joseph, right? So, um, they sent me a couple of products, or they gave me a couple of products, right? These some SOS aesthetics products and some other products of other Ghanaian brands to show you guys how, um, a full, how they all work together to bring um, a full face. So, Without much ado, let's get right into this video. So I'm just going to, you know, brush my brows up. Now let's get filled in. brother has products in it and there's a brother has no products in it so and you guys can see the clear difference okay guys so now that is it for the brows and what I'm going to be doing now is to be taking the lighter shade of the concealer and I'm going to just use it as a base for my eyeshadow, right? Alright, so now that that is nice and blended in, I'm going to go in with my Develess powder palette as usual. And I'm going to take a, one of the bigger fluffy brushes. And I'm just going to go in with one of the lighter shades. This one is called Chestnut. I'm just going to use it to set the concealer. Alright, so that's it. I'm going to go in with my um, outer crease brush, which is this one that I've been using forever. And then I'm going to go in to the shade called Dark Diva from the same developer's palette. And I'm just going to, you know, darken my outer crease areas. Okay guys, so that's it. I'm now going to go back into um, that with a regular shade of the concealer and I'm just going to dab it lightly around where I want my crease to be. So I'm not trying to exactly cut crease but I'm just trying to create um, a nice fine base for the pigment to sit on going to take the same brush that I used to set I'm not going to put it back into the powder I'm just going to use the remnants what is left on it to set I just kind of put the cut crease kind of situation and it's nice and well and I'm going to take this really small um, inner fluffy crease brush I know it's not like really the best for me to be using right now but I don't have any other one so I'm just going to go into the Vita Joseph pigment called Prepis this one when you open it it should be sealed if you know you if it's the first time it should be sealed like this so I'm just going to open it up I think it's about the amount I need so I'm just going to pick my I'm going to use this little mirror for precision sake I'm just going to take the brush and put it into the pigment a bit tap off the excess and then just um, tap it into my 
Peace area. Like man, if you guys can literally see what I am seeing here. Like if only you guys can see, like I look so glamorous. Look at this. See how that beauty melts into my skin? When I'm telling you guys about Ghanaian own brands, you guys should really start taking me seriously. Like, don't be thinking I'm playing because I'm not here to play with you. I am not. I am not here to play with you. Like, I ain't your maid, girl. Like, I ain't your maid. If you're not wearing a Vita Joseph like I am wearing, we are mates. Like, you can talk to me. You know what I mean? So, yeah. Let's do the other eye. Okay, guys. So, that is sitting there nice and pretty. Now, I want a darker shade to, you know... I want to smoke out my outer corners a bit. So I'm going to go in with this Anive um, contour powder. It's very dark. This is going to take a bit and I'm just going to smoke my outer corners a bit. Okay guys, so we are done with the eyes. The eye pigments are looking so flashy, so sassy, so classy. You can probably, you can use this for a bright house, night glam, daytime glam. Like, just do you boo. Like, for me, I'm totally digging this look. I can probably wear it anyway. But I don't have anywhere to go today, so, but then. I'm still looking, like, nice and fancy in my house. Let's get right into foundation. I've already prepped my skin with my, oh, let me. Let me just finish the eye look once and for all. Just going to go on my mascara and pour that bit in. Yeah, I think my mascara does the trick just fine. Alright, now, so it's time to move on to see how these lovely brushes are going to work. I'm going to start with the G100 Ultimate Face Buffer by Evita Joseph. And I'm going to go in with the SO Aesthetics um, Ultra Coverage Foundation from SO Aesthetics. I've already said that a bunch of times. This one is the Nokaimbia. And I'm going to just take a little pump at the back of my hand. And I'm going to take the brush and, you know, used to pick the product and um, spread it across my face. You guys already seen how the um, foundation is in the previous video so now we are testing the performance of the brush that was just one pump let's see how well the brush is going to blend it to my full face and how well it's going to look literally seen how flawless this is looking I used one and a half pumps of foundation in this brush and because the brush is dense it picks up the foundation well it is really soft and it just spreads it out so effortlessly and perfectly like you really don't need to be a professional to have this brush because it's even the best for beginners because you don't need to work much to get that product moving across your face all right so um i'm not really in the mood to highlight and contour today but for the sake of the video let's just do a little bit of highlighting okay guys so sometimes i do i start using the um small concealer brush to apply the Concealer. I still like to go in with the buffer once more to just smoothen out the rough lines and just make everything sit in there nice and clean. Like you guys need one of this brush in your makeup collection. You really can't play. Like you shouldn't be playing. Man, look at that. Girl. Girl, look at the application. Anyway, like this thing is giving me life. Like it's giving me life. So I'm just going to go back into my Develers palette and I'm going to go in with Honey and Chestnut. These two shades. To um, highlight my face. 
and I'm using the Vitagesia brush, the G120 all over powder brush. So this is also a Vita Joseph. This is the powder brush, the one G120 brush for powder. It's nice, soft and fluffy. So I'm just going to use that and you guys see how nicely it placed that color just at where it placed that powder where it was supposed to go like it's not even moving around it's just where I placed it and since I've got this brush I've actually stopped using sponges to apply um, certain powder to my face because I realized that the sponges pick way more product that I, I intend them to pick I don't know if it's because of my lack of skill but I just prefer this brush way better all right so I'm going to contour now with my old contour brush I'm going to go in with my lip liner where I thou and uh, let me try on the red for you guys first so let me just let me look for the red lip. So I have my red lip liner here. This one is from Anive Cosmetics. I'm going to just use that to line my lips quickly. I'm going to go in with the Evita Joseph um, Lip Gloss in Striker. This is the red. Just to show you guys quickly. This is how it comes out like. And I'm just going to put it on. guys that was just one pump like I just took it out once and then I filled the two lips so I'm just I just feel like going in one more time and then just put it on the top lip all right so I'm just going to take this brush again to wipe off this nice little highlight situation we have here and my that brush the brush i use for the crease i'm going to use the same thing to contour my nose and i'm going to go in with the so aesthetics um bronzer this one is in fiji i'm going to use the same evita joseph brush but before then let's do blush sorry i'm going to go with the anife cosmetics um blush i'm going to use the same g20 brush that i use for the powder and i'm just going to smile a bit pop that beauty in there and now I'm going to use the same brush, but the other side, I'm just going to go in with the SO Aesthetics bronzer. And I'm just going to go over that. Alright, so now, finally, I'm going to go in with the Lux Organics Hydrating Rose Water Mist. This is also made in Ghana brand. As I keep telling you guys, I'm just going to shake that up and I'm going to set this baby up. Just going to fan that in, let it sip in, and I'll come back to show you guys how the look look, how this look comes together with the red lipstick, and then we'll clean the red lipstick, do a nude one, and I'll show you guys how that looks, and then we'll see. This is the look we have with the red one. I'm just gonna feel myself as you guys look at me, and I drool over this if it's a Joseph beauty and find ways and means to start placing your orders this festive season and look glammed up like me so let's pop on the nude one in utility and I'll be right back to show you guys in the meantime I'm eating this thing is called Agbeli Kaklo Agbeli Kaklo Cassava Kaklo is what? Puffs? I don't know about my airway so it's called Agbeli Kaklo in airway <laughs> so I didn't just thought to let you guys know that anyway so let's pop this on alright Agbeli Kaklo is back I'm going to go on my brown lip liner now Okay, so now I'm going in with utility. So you 
you can just leave it on like this if you please or you can extend the lip gloss all the way up like this Okay, so if you are someone who don't really like the whole brown lip liner situation up there you can just extend the lip gloss up and then it will give you a really nice feel to nude lip so now let's check this out I promise you guys, I am so aware, like I am so 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 aware and my house is so aware, there's literally no day that there's no super 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 aware food in my house and this like Bali Gakko guys, it's so good, like it's so good I wish they had a brand on Instagram, I'd have tagged them, but like they're so good anyway this has been my review of the Vita Joseph, brushes, lip gloss and then eye pigments and the brow liner I'm, I'm totally in love with this, right? When he sent it to me, I decided to try them out for some time before I do this video. So I can give you guys an unbiased opinion and a really honest one. And this is my opinion, okay? These brushes are good. These lip glosses are good. They stay. Um, this brow liner literally stays in place all day. Like, nothing gets cracking and all of that. And the brushes just work together to perfect the looks well. So, I hope you like this video. You try it. I hope you buy something and check them out on Instagram at Evita underscore Joseph. Make a purchase and buy something for someone this festive season. And let me know in the comment section if you want to see more videos like this. If you want to see any particular brand being reviewed here, let me know and i'll do that for you so thank you so much for joining me on this one i love you and i'll see you on the next one and let me enjoy my good couple bye guys oh wait 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 before i forget don't forget to like this video by giving it a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe to this channel don't forget to share this video to your friends and family and don't forget to keep coming back here for more now bye guys